Previously on SLV, we packed up La Vagabond and hauled her out in New Zealand. It was the end of a wonderful journey, but only the beginning of another. Off we flew across the world to France. I get my cold. I'm going to ask Rally what we're doing and where we're going because that's what I usually do. Where are we going, Rally? Gare de Lyon. <laughs> we're going to the train station. Um, <laughs> we're about to get a uh, three and a half. Well, you guys know the deal. We've done this before. Last time we went to Paris. Gare de Lyon. Yes. Yes. Um, yeah, three and a half hours on the train. This time we will not be late, late for a very important date. Um, we're going to go see Riley's mum and then we're gonna go see the new boat. We're gonna have a sneak peek. We're going home. We're going home. Cannot wait to not have to lug all this luggage around. There's just too much of it. I hate lugging luggage. Me too. We got a lot of stuff. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Mate. <laughs> what? I thought Joe just wiped that. <laughs> there you go. We've just rocked up to Mum's house. But there's no beds. <laughs> Yeah, we've moved in for the night. Say hello, Maureen. Hello, how are you? Thanks for having us. That's okay, you're very welcome. Well, it's a hell of a lot warmer here than Paris. Is it? I think it's 16 degrees here. It was like, what was it? I think it was 10 in Paris. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Why? Hold on. It's, it's much warmer, isn't it? So nice. So nice. Thank you. Goodness, what are you doing? Up the back. Hello. Hello. We have just spotted the Vagabond. Wow. Over there. Oh my gosh. Oh, it looks huge. Wow, it's beautiful. It looks so much better in real life. Yeah. Should we get closer? Or should we wait till tomorrow? <laughs> I'm too scared. I don't want to go near it. It's scary. <laughs> Whoa, Riley, that's it. That is amazing. It was a Sunday and the keys for the dock were inside the Ultramer office, which was closed. We had to wait until tomorrow to see her, so we spent the day exploring instead. Well, we didn't get very far, but this is Le Grand Mott. It's located 604 kilometres south of Paris on the Mediterranean side of France. Uh, yeah, so we've got about 10,000 locals living here year round, mostly retired people, but somewhere around 2 million tourists visit this place per year. And I think it's because of the long sandy beaches and the port's pretty incredible. Uh, one thing you'll notice about Le Grand Mott is the architecture, which is what Mathieu pointed out to us. Uh, it's pretty unique. It was built in the 60s and 70s, and it's not like anything else you'll see in France. So you'll either love it or you'll hate it. <laughs> Now, the following is a sponsored piece, but all I have to do is encourage people to read, so I'm pretty happy about that. I like reading books, and what I've been doing for a while now, on top of my music and podcasts, is to download books from Audible and listen to them on my headphones. Now, there are a few points that I've been asked to cover, but this isn't one of them. One thing that was important for me personally before I started listening to audiobooks at all was that I needed to make sure that I understood and remembered the same as if I had actually read the book. A quick Google showed me that comprehension and retention were comparable and actually better for some people. So what I was... Riley, are you listening to me? Chapter 5, page 31. He was an old man who fished Mr. alone in a skiff in, a skiff in the Gulf in Stream the Gulf and he had gone 84 days now without taking a fish. In the first 40 days, a boy had been with him. But after 40 days without a fish... The book the that I've just finished listening to is The Old Man in the Sea. Uh, narrated by Donald Sutherland, his mellifluous voice will melt like honey into your ears. It takes about two and a half hours and is good for children and adults alike. Obviously, this weather's taking a turn for the worst. If you head to www.audible.com forward slash SLV, you'll be able to get a 30 day free trial and you don't have to get the old man to see you can get any book that you want. So, um, yeah, if that's all, I might head back to the hotel because I'm getting blown down the road here. <laughs> Link is in the description below, guys. Link's in the description below. Thank you, Elena. Good morning, everyone. 
guess what we're doing this morning? We are going to see the new boat. We're going to catch up with Matthew and the crew, maybe grab a coffee. Um, yeah, been waiting for this moment for a very long time. We went and saw it last night. We had a little sneak peek last night from across the water, <laughs> but we couldn't it. touch it. We couldn't touch it. I've been up since two. We didn't want to wake up Maureen, so we went for a run. We're just fine. Tantalizingly close. Yeah, it's teasing us so badly. Good morning, Maureen. Good morning. <laughs> excited. Yeah. Yeah. Say hello, Matthew. <laughs> and cheers. cheers. Lovely cheers. to see you again. Is it allowed to, to chill on coffee? I don't know, maybe. Strong <laughs> day. Yay! Let's unlock the door. Right, here's the key. It smells so new. I know, I remember this smell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. Look at my kitchen. Oh, wow, it is way bigger than I remember. It's amazing. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you, big fella. Really I know you've done so mate. much, yeah, like helping us get the boat to to this and you've done so much behind the scenes so thank you. What do you think Maureen? Oh it's amazing, absolutely amazing. <laughs> oh, it, it is really amazing. I, I just love it. I'm going to go for an exploration. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to go jump on the tramps. Can I jump on the tramps yet? Of course. Yay! Yay! <laughs> The batteries are in the other side with the water maker. There's one battery each. Yeah, one battery for each engine. Oh no, but the, the lithium batteries. No, these are lead, lead batteries for the engine. Yeah. Well. Yeah. 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 We got Maureen practicing the guitar. Yeah. Chords. Yeah. 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 We got Maureen practicing guitar chords. <laughs> Raz is in the kitchen making us a soup. Raz and uh, in the kitchen, up the medicine. We've all just had a fabulous day. <laughs> Have a little nap in the middle of the oh, day. We're really still very alone. jet lagged. Yes. Riley's making fun of me because I spat the dummy earlier because the internet's slow. The upload speed's really slow. <laughs> so I got a little bit grumpy, but I'm jet lagged, so I'm allowed. <laughs> yes, you are. Okay, what was I was intrigued about is you could um, strum down and also back. Yeah. It sounds the same. Yeah. What's all that about? <laughs> 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 Seriously, what's all that about? I was really intrigued by that. Ah, <laughs> oh, Professor Dollar. Oh, this is what I found. This is this is um. Let it be. Okay. Oops. That didn't sound too good. practicing till your fingers blister yeah and then you know you've oh. done a good job it is isn't it? I'm very lucky good morning everyone so we have moved rooms we've moved out of Maureen's house um, thought it was about time we got our own place and we're at the hotel across the road at the McEwa they're having us for a few nights and today is Friday, it's the first day sort of of the event. Tonight we have aperitif with all the team who made our boat. Yeah, that should be good. And then, yeah, we're full on for the next two days, flat out, aren't we? Good morning. Good morning, Ross. <laughs> um, yeah, we're really looking forward to this weekend. It's gonna be awesome and a good opportunity for us to thank everyone because we wouldn't, you know, none of this would have happened without all of those guys, all of you guys. Mainly, I am looking forward to getting in the thing and sailing off because that's what I enjoy the most. That's what we do best. Yeah, so. Not long now, well, I think we can move on board next week. Yeah, yeah? I think that's so. That's what Matt, you said. Check out the fog, guys. 
I'd gone out to a bakery and came back to find my three best mates from Australia who'd surprised me for the event. <laughs> we managed to convince Matthew to take us all out for a sneaky little sail in La Vagabond before the event this weekend. Ratsy was getting beers and he got left behind. But luckily, Machu is the ultimate manoeuvrer. Classy. He's very lucky. <laughs> now get on. Go, go, go. Music. <laughs> Only music. <laughs> it's a wide ocean and the tides in motion and Homes are chosen, yet still we're all broken It's been a while now, since that old town Down by the water, picking stones from the ground Take me home To the friends I've always known walking through the sheds and I'm vlogging and Matthew's vlogging me vlogging hello Matthew and we're going to say a big thank you to all the team for making our boat yeah the guys that actually built it yeah the nuts and bolts the Wait, lads, oh. the soldiers Yo. The team put together this little video that played on a TV in the room and I nearly cried. It was just so sweet. Hi there, you've been dreaming of it for a long time and now the big day has come. Everybody at Outremer put the very best of themselves to achieve that and uh, here is what we put in your boat. Fiber glass. Jalcot. Resin. Foam. Wood. Rudder. It helps. The reservoir. Electrical system. Power. Postcock. Working hours, rescue boat, shower, team spirit, the toilet, French touch, with love, the pump bacal, comme ça vous coulez pas. And now we wish you a bonne poursuite dans l'aventure. Je vous souhaite un bon voyage. Some wind, some sun, une bonne bringue. <laughs> Le meilleur, que le meilleur. Have fun, memories, bon vent, meet people. Have a nice trip from the wizard of the wire. Um, but I went for my first sail today and it was just the best moment. There was sunshine and you guys did that. So thank you so much. Um, I hope we return one day with the boat in the exact same condition. Let's all enjoy a drink together. And uh, once again, thank you very much, especially for the bilge pump. <laughs> We're all falling and we need a place to hide A safe place somewhere in the woods we can start the fire You didn't bang that, you scolded. You nearly got bang. Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> all we know is what we We will stay So, it's the end of the evening Oh, I'm just going to turn the volume down It's the end of the night <laughs> Who doesn't have a seatbelt on? Me? Yeah. Oops <laughs> I don't have my seatbelt on <laughs> Anyway, we're all going out to an Italian restaurant How do you feel about that guys? Fantastic Italiano? Oh. Meatballs <laughs> no, And we, no. tomorrow morning, we have to be up and at the office at 9.30 because uh, we have the some way. interviews Fabio. with Fabio. some journalists, Fabio. I believe you sound so far away, Ratsy. It's because I am. I'm in the boot. <laughs> in the boot. In the boot. He's in the boot. Sub boot. <laughs>
Up next, we celebrate some more with the weekend. It's our boat launch party. So it's a whole two days of champagne and meeting fans from all over the globe. We also do a Q&A and boogie the night away at the Yacht Club. Nobody knows And we leave it all behind Can't you see?